game going in here. We are going to PS2, very neutral setting. Definitely love PS2. Um, so I think this is kind of going to be very interesting. We need to see how kind of, you know, Dill, how she actually kind of breaks this kind of situation here. Already kind of seeing was put to the ledge by Suarez and just kind of trying to not really like do too much. I mean, honestly, we've seen a very aggressive a game already from Suarez, just putting on 58% uncontested. Yep, it's uh, we actually saw an interesting thing. Suarez uh, off that conversion with the throw took the one up air and then waited a little bit before doing the second one. So getting a little Absolutely. bit of a download on the option, as well as looking for potential uh, air dodge early on in the set, which is interesting. We'll see how that pans out. Uh, Yoshi's fine. That was that was so good though. Do mm -hmm. you know what just happened? Dill saw that that's exactly what Suarez wanted to do, and then like the egg, and then once you know Suarez went for the second egg toss, mm -hmm. she actually jumped from the platform, used Nair, and then that just automatically set up for that side B right there. That's so amazing, and they're both at even percents right now, mm -hmm. um, 94 to 88. This is kind of crazy. And yes. Wow! Got him with the forward air. Very nice. Uh, low Ooh. catch on that one, scaring with the eggs. It is very intimidating to try to get off the ledge there because Yoshi can chase very well if that egg does hit. And you want to know kind of the one thing that we definitely love from Suarez is Suarez like, is really good at kind of really pressuring a lot of these um, platform situations. When somebody is on the platform, they pressure with either, um, you know, they either pressure with um, egg lay um, or just like with down and all together and I really love you know a lot of the pressure that they have when they're on you know kind of trying to punish people's um you know ludge habit or platform habit sorry mm -hmm. uh, that's an interesting uh, uh, interaction actually the egg when it hits the gyro doesn't break it but actually bounces it away which is uh, a point in Yoshi's favor on this one because that means that Rob has to either chase the gyro uh, or wait for it to go away before you can use another one as opposed to like hitting a shield when gyro just goes away immediately so it's not in Dill's favor on that one, but closing out a stock on that one uh, in the hundreds is a little difficult on this one, but Rob can definitely put out the damage in the early kills if anyone can. Absolutely. Now, I think this is kind of where we're struggling a little bit because we'll see a lot of situations where Dill, she's in the corner, and then um, she is kind of just like waiting for Suarez and just kind of waiting in this very, you know, neutral position. Although she is in the corner, she's not really too scared of what can happen. Mm -hmm. And we definitely love that type of like, you know, patience coming in from um, Dill because it's just like, you know, you have to be very careful. Um, Suarez isn't really going for too much of what you would think of, just going for a lot of like, you know, a, a lot of aggressive positioning mm -hmm. in terms of just like where Suarez actually wants to be in relative position or relative, um, you know, miss to actually, yep. you Went know, for stage the control. Off that one. Scary position on that one. Rob's a little bit of a big body. Dill gonna opt to reset it ledge. Get back on stage with the gyro. Very nice. Take center stage. And see, Dill, she's worked this stock uh, to kill percent from quite the deficit. Very patient play on that one. We'll chase off stage now. Let's see if this can convert into a kill. Down there up on there. Ooh, Suarez has been really good at covering uh, potential like checkmate and death angles with the eggs. Absolutely. Ooh, the and shield that's poke, absolutely yeah. gonna kill. The thing that I kind of want to mention is that, like as you said, she's been loving this entire time. You know, to be able to kind of just really make it hard for Suarez to actually kill her was actually just really amazing. She may have them at 182%, but that fair is just going to immediately take that stock. And we're going to be to a very even position. I really like how she kind of just slowed it down more than she already was taking it mm -hmm. and just took it to such an even position. Almost even in the lead at this point, you know, 38% isn't much of a lead, but it's something. And she is going to run with that. Mm -hmm. It's absolutely something that uh, Rob can totally work with if it can bring uh, the character to the edge and get a lot of potential damage on there. But Suarez with some good combo damage himself, turning back from ledge. Egg's doing a lot of work on this one to apply pressure. Gets in on that one, but actually crosses up on shield. So I'm still looking for the shield grab. Uh, wrong way on that one. But. Still still looking pretty good on this one, holding center stage pretty tightly. Actually beats the out of shield option on that one. Spaced out Nair to where it was difficult to get any sort of punish. Ooh, that looked like a weird uh, mm -hmm. laser, but I mean, yeah, they're both at a very, oh. it's, just, it's just very. Yeah, no ooh. jump. That's it. That was a very nice game coming in from Dill. I honestly, I really love how like slow she took that. She took that so slow and it mm -hmm. literally just worked out. Like it just paid dividends for her because like she was down that entire first talk and then she immediately brought it back and that was so amazing mm -hmm. like hello 
Yep, it's uh, it was definitely a lot of uh, slow-paced work on that one, but I would say that Rob, between the two of them, eggs are definitely threatening and scary, especially like at that mid-percent where they start uh, really popping you up and you have to work to get yourself back down while Yoshi closes in. Uh, but things like the gyro play, just a little bit of lasers here and there, really had a uh, death by a thousand cuts sort of effect. And don't bring it back, but we're going to go back to PS2 for game two. Absolutely, and this is... Maybe kind of is just that, you know, maybe Suarez isn't using actually a lot of those, you know, um, eggs. I mean, Ooh. just this advantage. I mean, I lied. Never mind. You know, their advantage and aggression is really good enough to actually kind of bring this to 93%. Already at 100.3. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, 100.3. And just making it, like, very good advantage coming in from Suarez. Yep. And we're seeing a little bit of uh, slowdown from Dill. Looking for a little bit of zoning, a little bit of uh, damage here, there. Landing with the Nair, auto cancel, then going for the down tilt right after. Very quick move, very smart off from go for in CQC. Although Suarez catching with the back air will take the stock only at 100% on this one. That'll definitely kill, though. Absolutely. For sure. But this is an even game again. I mean, um, you know, Dill, she definitely made that end. Wow, ooh, very nice. A uh, little, little bit of a thing there. Yep, Dill's not the only one here with uh, gyro item drop combos. Absolutely. Now, this is a very nice kind of situation that they both want to be in. They don't want to really be in too much of a high percent. They still kind of want to play a little bit more neutral so they can find out what each other kind of wants to do. Mm -hmm. And it's looking a little bit scary just because, you know, although they're playing neutral, it's like, what can they do? Yeah, there's a lot of... Um Sort of playing a little bit safe and trying to look for a commitment on that one. Oh, that Ooh. conversion will do it. Absolutely. Going to take that stock. Very nice early percent coming in from Dill. That was absolutely so amazing right there. Now, the kind of thing that um, I also would like to point out some more is just that, you know, when it comes to, like, gyro and just um, disadvantage altogether, I really like the kind of differences that we've seen from both like Dill and Zamba. Zamba definitely chooses more of an aggressive approach mm -hmm. to get down, but from Dill, she actually used, like she, I remember she used or had a lot of, um, you know, she had gyro in hand most of the time to actually help her recover um, from a very like bad position. Really bounce Yoshi Egg on that one. And yeah, we are seeing, uh, like you say, a bit more defensive on that one, trying not to play uh, too aggressive on this one, especially with a lead like this. If you can continue getting little bits of damage here and there, why not? Oh, drag down bear confirmed. Okay, that was very nice drag down combo from Suarez. And gonna get hit by that gyro, but Suarez definitely needs to be careful. This is exactly what happened to them. That first game where they lost their jump, I think it was taken by Dill. Nice, but yeah, the back air was going to be the death of Suarez, losing that set 2 0. Very nice play from Dill. We loved it. Mm -hmm. And even if that was spaced out, there was a very precarious situation to be. Uh, back air over the gyro. If you fade too far in the opposite direction, gyro is right there. Um, you, If you go further in, obviously, you face something like this where uh, Dill can shield. So it looks like Dill running forward was actually a response to that. Suarez trying to space out for uh, Dill otherwise staying in place, but there with the shield and with the punish, which Absolutely. was very strong. That was a very nice game from both of them, 